compare the numbers for the second quarter. For homes sold, interior home sales have dropped this year compared to the last three years, whereas golf course homes are up compared to the last three years, as are waterfront sales. Let's look at the price per square foot for homes that sold. Remember, all numbers are averages. For the second quarter, we see a spread of $18 for interior homes, $11 for golf course homes, and $53 for waterfront homes. Days on market. The second quarter numbers for interior and golf homes reflect high days on market because of the high days on market for two particular homes that actually closed in June. One had been on the market for over 1,500 days. Waterfront home sales show only a slightly increase for 2016. The number of home sales pending on June 30th for interior homes was down in 2015, but way up in 2016 closer to normal. Pending sales of golf course homes is up for 2016, while waterfronts are down by about 50 percent. Looking at the raw numbers for active homes in June, one might be concerned with the high number of homes for sale, which is 156. But looking at the national average for the percentage of homes for sale in any particular subdivision shows that Bentwater is in line with that average of 8 percent. For interior homes and golf course homes, the number of active homes is up, but much of that is due to the new construction of homes on the interior. Number of active waterfronts is down. The average price per square foot for active listings is steady across the board for 2015 and 16. The numbers for 20 and 13 and 2014 are unavailable.